Flex Digits, Prison Planet, we're with Zane Ajwai, what up Zane? What up? Yo, we're going to get in some questions with Zane, he's, he's over here, you might have seen my battle, uh, when this gets uploaded, my battle with Zane will be coming up, is it, how long is it, about three weeks it'll be up, it'll be up online on Don't Flop, thought we'd get in there, asking a few questions, um, so let's get into it, uh, so how did you get into, how did you get into battle rap? Well, I started out doing, I, well, I started out doing freestyle on beats, battles, and thinking got skills in Malaysia, that's like our equivalent to uh, Scribble Jam. I did that a couple of years ago, uh, won a few battles, though I never won the championship. And uh, I realized we needed a written battle league, so I, since no one else was doing it, I started my own and it went from there. I started traveling because I realized since we had a small country, we needed to travel to increase our fan base. So, cool. Do you want to hold that while I'm doing it? Like, if I, if I ask a question and pass it, yeah. Okay, sure. What's your, what's your greatest childhood memory? I have many great childhood memories, but just for the fans, I'll talk about this one particular memory. When I was a kid, I was in uh, computer robotics class, and we had to make robotics out of Legos and program them. I made a vibrator from Legos when I was about like uh, 10, 8 years old or something. And even though it was offensive, my teacher uh, couldn't degrade me or insult me because it was a pretty damn good design, a vibrator from Legos. What's your favorite performance in a, uh, in a battle? Obviously not just uh, in England, in Australia, what out of all the performances, what's your favorite one? Well, not biased, real talk. My best performance is against Mr. Flex Digits. The first two rounds, uh, because I really trained hard for that, um, I tried to go a certain angle in the third round, but Flex said, no man, that's not true. And it, went, it felt kind of awkward, so I fucked up the third round, but first two rounds I reckon were my favorite performance ever. Um, second is the one in Australia against Threats for Grind Time Now Australia. Cool. I don't know if that's a good thing that he's, uh, he said he enjoyed writing for me the most. Um, that means he, he took you took most pleasure in writing insults about me. No, it's not because of that. To be honest with you, you're one of the best guys I've faced. Uh, no, here, I'm, no, here, I'm not Gris. Mark Gris is great, but this guy's got actual music. He's got, you know, uh, he's a ra real rapper's rapper. So I had to work extra hard for him. I've found other guys who make music, but with all due respect to them, they're good as well. But Flex is the most technically gifted of all of them. Uh, real talk. Thank you very much, Shane. Thank you. Um, so if Hollywood made a film about you, uh, who would you like to play yourself? Wow. I don't know. Um, I'd say a newcomer. Or better yet, to make more money for myself, I should play myself to get paid. Yeah, that's it. You also do a bit of acting, don't you? Don't know yes, I'm also an actor. In Malaysia, I've been in several TV shows for prime time. And you can see me in my debut uh, acting role on television in Weera Sithwi. I play a nerdy computer hacker in a film about a girl, get this, who gets raped. Hey, you can't do it um, if, we were to, if, we, <laughs> if we were to go into your house now, what are we likely to find in your fridge? We're likely to find um, meats, chickens and fish, to be honest, because I'm a protein guy. Um, if you could punch anyone in Don't Flop in the face, who would it be and why? Mm. Well, I don't know if there's anyone in Don't Flop, but if it comes to actual fun, I punch flex digits because I know he can fight back. I don't punch people who don't fight back. That's real man shit. I respect that, I respect that. <laughs> <laughs> we all know he can fight back, come on. <laughs> Have you seen the Hollahan sex tape? I'm afraid not, but I do not uh, condemn such a thing. As long as it gets you views and people download it and pay Hollahan, go Jeff. Is it gay for a man to give another man a massage? Um, no it isn't, unless it's of a sexual nature, but I prefer massages from women, especially if sex is included in, pack in the package. Have you eaten fish and chips while you've been here? Of course, I always eat fish and chips when I'm in England. In fact, the fish and chips in England is so good, I don't eat it in Malaysia anymore. 
Did you do fish and chips in Malaysia? Yeah. Uh, but it's crap compared to the one in, Mal in, in the UK. The one in Malaysia, they get it all wrong. They have french fries, not chips. It's never beer barrel, and it's never haddock or cod. It's always this other shit. I'm going to get on some of the uh, Twitter and Facebook uh, questions. Um, I put it up on it as a states in a tweet earlier. Some people obviously get about like, quite a few here, so I'm just going to go through a few of these questions now. Uh, Andrew Hagley, I think you pronounce it, uh, asks, have you ever been raped? I'm afraid I have never been raped. I'm sorry to disappoint. I'm capable of defending myself against rapists. Okay. Tom Ball asks, if you could battle anyone, who would it be? Hall of the Dawn. But then again, that's a dream matchup. Reality is a different issue. So in, rela in reality? In reality, who I would, what, you mean who I would, who I, who I would battle realistically? Yeah. Is that the nature of the question? Um, I would want to battle J-Pro. Uh, um, but then I don't know if that's realistic or not because he's probably going to get buzzed from King of the Dot. Um, I suppose uh, Plasma from the Philippines, don't fl uh, in flip top, that's realistic, but I love to bow him at one point. Uh, in Don't Flop, I love to bow, hmm, actually who I would, pamphlet, yeah, at one point. Good. Nash from DFI Island uh, asks, is your knife game really crazy? Um, it's not as crazy as Chase from Australia. That guy is much better than I am. The guy is a professional butcher and he knows how to do all the cool knife game shit. So he's a lot better than I am. So although I say my knife game is crazy, I don't dare say it's as crazy as certain other people like Chase. Uh, Leon Ward asks, uh, he'd, he'd like to know what knife is the best for, obviously, displaying your butchery with a knife. What, what what knife is your personal favorite? In reality, it's best not to use a knife when attacking someone because it is recognized as a weapon under the law, you know? So if you're caught with a knife and you just stab someone or whatever, you're probably likely to get prosecuted. If you really, really want to stab someone, better use a household object like a pen or a toothpick or a ruler that's broken because these are seen as household objects that are totally legal and you can't get prosecuted for in be having possession of such items. <laughs> no job. No job. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, Pete Cashmore um, asks, uh, how does autism affect you and um, what sort of advantages or disadvantages does it give you um, as far as rap battling is concerned? Well, Autism has affected my social ability, to be honest. So let me put it this way: when your girlfriend, your when your girlfriend asks you if she's fat, there's that part of your brain that tells you if you tell her she is fat, you're not getting laid. That part of your brain is supposed to advise you on what is socially inappropriate and what is appropriate. It's instinctive; it's not taught to you. You just know it. That part of my brain is missing. So unless spoken to otherwise, I would just say you look fat, like me. <laughs> But I've been able to counter-react against it by having, by memorizing certain social rules which I go, which I abide by on my day-to-day -day life. But I ignore these rules when I bow, of course. Um, Earl was suggested that uh, one advantage I have is that I don't care about other people's feelings um, on a natural basis, which makes me a better battle rapper, I suppose. I'm also good at focusing which means as long as I'm given enough time for a particular opponent and I don't do anything else, I'm going to be pretty good at like when I battle threats. Um, I come up with punchlines all the time, uh, multi-syllables and things like that, so I really, really focus and dedicate to what I'm doing. Uh, but And I spot things that no one else spots, like I talked about uh, Vams from Australia being half black when no one else noticed it because, you know, I noticed it, he mentioned that he was part Aborigine, he's mentioned that in one battle, but no one else noticed it. Thing with a lot of people, they don't pick up on small, minute, seemingly irrelevant details, but I do. Disadvantages, um, well, real talk though, unless you really love your battle rap shit, don't get into it because, uh, especially when you're when you got autism, when you're really focused on battling or when you're focused on rap or whatever it is that you want to do, uh, I ignore everything else in my life and uh, I have to pay the price on a, pers on a personal level.
good answer, by the way. Um, Alex Atrobas, sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, um, asks, is there a line in battling? Let me put it this way, I don't believe there should be a line in battling because it defeats the whole purpose of a battle. The uh, concept of a battle is to offend another person in a witty, intellectual, well-crafted, strategic way. And whether we like it or not, the best way to offend someone is to hit below the belt. They, no one can deny that, right? But however, if your opponent uh, explicitly tells you something should not be mentioned, and you agree, it is your role as a man to keep to that bond. If you explicitly tell him no rules, and he agrees to that, um, to that concept, and you guys bow, he has no right to be angry at anything you say. But if you guys explicitly agree not to mention cert certain things, and you go, I lie, that's a bitch move. If you were on death row, uh, what would be your final meal? Um, a cake, because then my friends can put some acid in it, then I can, you know, burn through the bars and try to escape. Uh, at yes fam asks, um, who's your favourite battle rapper? We haven't, we haven't done that one yet, it's a surprise. Who's your favourite battle rapper? My personal favourite is Hall of the Dawn, because the problem with many battlers is that they need a lot of s long setups with complex multis to build up to a punchline, and they can't do it without doing that. With Hall of the Dawn, he ha can have these relatively simple multis, and it's so effective. Some guys have great punchlines, but they don't have the complex, uh, complex multi-syllable structures. Some guys have the complex multi-syllable structures, but they like the mm and the punchlines, you know what I'm saying? Hall of the Dawn, in my opinion, combines the best of both worlds. And he's got Squagger, so he's not a nerd. Uh, and he's got a dope voice and he's got dope presence and confidence. I am Brendan Darkwell, Batman or Spider-Man? Batman. I go for Batman because Batman would come up with a way to take out Spider-Man. If you look at Spider-Man, he's pretty easy to take out. I mean, as long as something fucks up his hands, he's gone. Because he needs them to stick to, to, stick to the walls, he needs them to do that willing bullshit. So as long as some some guy comes up with a way to fuck up his hands, he's gone. And Batman is the kind of guy who would come up with a way to fuck up Spider-Man. Um, do you know how to make a cup of coffee? Damn straight. Kettles on, milk two sugars. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's the end of the interview. Shout out to Zayn Azurai, Evil Poet Society. No, it's M.Y. Barrels now, Evil Poet Society. Is no longer around, we're revamping it. NY Battles, my rap battle league in Malaysia. You might see me there 2013, you never know, I might be back in Malaysia to battle. Okay, and I think Flex, can you feel me about my 10 pounds now? No, it's my idea. Two pounds on me. <laughs> 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 <laughs>